Chase that I'm hanging on. And today we're visiting Poland. So tonight we're making pierogies, stuffed peppers, and for dessert we're making kolaches. So let's get to it. So Hayden's peeling her potato it's for not, the plat or the pierogi filling. A few thousand. And we've got Nate over here chopping up an onion, and that is for our stuffed peppers. And the onion coming along. Chop it up, chop it up, chop it up. All right, here. Hayden is browning some meat here for our stuffed peppers, and I'm gonna get going on cutting up. The I'm potato. the knife sharpener. No more pink. Take turns. Mincing the garlic. Get it all minced out. We're gonna Sweet, tight, take... all the way tight. Tight. Okay, scrape that off there. Take the knife here. Okay, it's time to get the peppers ready to stuff. What's so we're problem? just supposed to cut off the top. So are we done with the appetizer now? No, we're just getting parts of it done each time. Okay. As we go, to make sure timing is right. Look at all my seeds on it. So the appetizer, the pierogies, we had to get the potatoes boiling so we can mash them. So that's why we started working on that. But now we need to get these done so we can get them in the oven. Mom, splash with camera. We're just rinsing the seeds out. So we've got it all cleaned out. We have spices out of the pantry and Travis is over here cutting the pepper tops into finely chopped pieces of pepper to put in our mixture for the stuffed peppers. Can I do one? I do one. Okay, so we have Hayden's mixing up the spices, the onions, the garlic, the peppers, and, and the pretty meat. much everything for the pierogies. And the rice. This is going in the stuffed peppers, which are sitting right there on the counter. Oh, stuff they were going in. Good and mixed up, Hayden. They will, you, we will stuff the stuff. What are you doing, Ranger? Stuff. Okay, the kids are stuffing up the peppers, doing a good job there. It smells amazing. Smell it, smell it, guys, smell it. We wish we had a smell meter for you guys. <laughs> Scratch and sniff. Is that it? That's. Nope, all the way to the top, as much as you can. Oh, okay. Okay, and one of the last steps here before we put the stuffed peppers in the oven is to put two cups of tomato juice on top. So that's what Hayden's working on you now. That's good. Exactly. Right on top. And then Chad, you do the second cup, okay? Okay. Pour it in there, Hayden. Let's go. There you go. Hi, Karen. Hi, Karen. Hi, Karen. Hey, hey, Why don't you move down. your water bottle all the way there, buddy? There you go. Hey, set it down. Don't touch it. Hate it. I literally just said don't touch it. Hayden, you can let it go. He's got it. Good job. There. All right, and just pour it all around. It's going to square. Get over here a little. There we go. Now we're gonna cover them with foil and put them in the oven for one hour. One hour? hour? That's a long time. It'll be out in 807. <laughs> Pure tomato juice. Okay, so since the kids have never had tomato juice before, we're doing the one shot of tomato juice challenge. Cheers. To grossness. Drink it all up. Drink it. They did it. Look at that. It's actually not that bad. No, you like it? What do you think, Trap? Mm. You did it though. We're starting our black cheese yogurt eating a sugar of butter and green cheese. And then we're eating our apricot buddy. 
make the filling with dried fruit. So we're gonna make some filling with that and then probably some jelly and Nutella because Vicky does not like jelly. Sugar. All right, we have the stuffed peppers in the oven, the apricots going on the stove, our potatoes are just about done, and our clotchkito is ready to chill. In the freezer. All right, so we're adding the cheese to the potato mixture, pour it inside the pierogies, and then we're going to get to making those. We have to roll out the dough and fill them. All right, we have our pierogi dough all rolled out, and now we're going to cut the circles, and it says to easily use the top of a cup. Mm. That's good. It shouldn't take much. Good job, guys. here into the blender. Lock it in. Okay, pulse it. Jake, I need to get in that drawer, buddy. You have to move. Yeah. Come here with that. Yeah. Hold it up. And we'll load them up here from our pierogies. Hi! They're Polish dumplings. Pretty much. Wait, let's, did you guys know I dyed my hair? Let's do Everybody knows us. Let's do six at a time, okay. Hey, guys. Don't just dump them in there. Just set them down really nicely and kind of turn them over. Okay. Hey, guys. That is just what I said not to do. Sorry. Well, hopefully they're cooking okay. Hey guys. Hey guys. First ones came out. Hopefully they're done. Okay. To fry up the pierogi so we can finally eat some food. And Jake has not moved an inch. Well, maybe an inch around the corner the whole time. Are you helping Jake, our old man? Probies yet? Almost. That's frying them now. Okay. So different from most recipes, it actually says to put powdered sugar to roll out the cookies, which. I've never done before, but makes a whole lot of sense when you're making something sweet and you don't want to add extra flour. So we're going to roll these to about a fourth inch thick. That is powdered sugar. Some more powdered sugar. It's getting bigger. And pepper. Some more powdered sugar. Do you know how many cookies this recipe makes? No. I like more powdered sugar. That's okay. Okay, cut them out. So it traditionally calls for a square cookie cutter. Whoa, that's way too much. Okay. Well, I got the rest. But we don't have a square, so we are improvising. 
with circles, footballs, flowers, and stars. It all tastes the same, right? Yeah! Trap's gonna have to wash his hands first. Yes. Okay, so we're gonna fill our first one here. It says about a teaspoon. And we're just gonna pinch in the edges. Just like that. We'll show them to y'all when we're done. I'm gonna use one. And... Lord on! Okay, here. Okay, the cookies are coming along. How was it, Trav? Yeah. Meh. Meh. Very it? hard. It's good. It is okay, very hard. Okay, we gotta hard. go play one more there. This is very hard. How do these Polish people do it? Trevor just came out. Teach. Polish people teach me. Mama. Good. Are you hungry? Yes, I'm very hungry. Are you hungry? Well, here is dinner. Stuffed peppers and pierogies. What's your main dish? The stuffed pepper. Subscribe. Plus. Plus, please. More like a B plus. A minus. I'm gonna go try them. Okay, in true ch child fashion, the kids are a little freaked out by the peppers. I, I think it's really good. I do too. All of it's really good. It's all really good. The pierogies turned out pretty good. Mm -hmm. The pepper is fantastic. But stay tuned because we still have the college keys and the interesting facts. Okay. Poland's most famous person is Pope John Paul II. Chief exports machinery, electronics, vehicles, and vehicles. The population is 38.43 million. Sport, soccer, and football, which are the same things. They have temperate cold winters with warm summers affected by ocean air currents. And that is all for, for the, the fun, fun facts about Poland. Time for the cooking. Dessert is served. Oh, that was crispy. I'm trying raspberry. What do you guys think? Mmm. Mm. Pretty good. It's okay. Hey mom, there's a little something right there. <laughs> Powdered sugar? <laughs> <laughs> they're yummy. Yeah. They're good. I'd say it's a success. Dessert was really good. That is definitely something that I'm going to make again. I'm going to make it for my kids. And maybe we'll do this. Maybe we'll have a YouTube video for my kids too. Who knows? Okay, who gets to pick for next week this week? Me! Hayden's turn again? Yeah. Okay. It's already been five That's weeks. got it. Four. Four more weeks and this is the fifth. You're choosing for the fifth, huh? Australia! Australia. Yum! Is that a Stop. continent? Yes. I know. It's yeah. a country and a continent. It's a continental country. There you go. We are the seven continents of the world you live on. Okay. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed Enjoy our video. video. Please subscribe. Comment down below. Would, Would you, you eat, eat this? Give us a big thumbs up and we'll see you guys.